G'day folks. Well, a few people have asked me recently what is so dangerous about magnetrons. Uh, apart from dropping it on your foot or getting your fingers pinched between two of the magnets, the really dangerous part is the ceramic insulators. As they are, they're completely inert and harmless. You can do pretty much anything with them apart from break them up. When you smash them up and turn them into dust, they become an airborne hazard, a very dangerous one, because beryllium is quite toxic to the human body, and the dust that you produce will lodge in your lungs and start causing rather nasty little problems, probably lung cancer and maybe something called beryllosis, I think it is. Um, it's not particularly nice stuff. The rest of the magnetrons just metal and magnets, so you don't have to worry about that. Uh, maybe some sharp edges if you're really careless with sharp objects, but working with stainless steel pretty much four days a week and everything else this time of the week, my fingertips turn to leather so I don't even bother wearing gloves. Um, the only thing that cut me recently was the um, nylon housing on a pool pump. I've been rebuilding pool pumps all week, so of all things that cuts me, it's a damn plastic housing. <laughs> Never mind the metal bits. Um... Yeah, don't smash or grind these insulators. If you have to get the copper out of the core cylinder, the core that's under these aluminium fins is welded onto the stainless steel ends there. There's a seam. So if you have to get it off, cut it there. Don't cut into the ceramic or grind it. Grinding it would be the worst because you end up with a fine powder. Uh, it's very tough to actually smash. I mean, I've thrown this magnetron on the ground and bent the antenna but it is very hard to break it you actually have to strike it hard against a metal surface like put it there and hit it with a hammer but don't let that fool you sometimes they'll just break anyway um, yeah so if you're gonna pull them apart just try not to smash those and you'll probably live a bit longer but then people like me we take risks anyway hell I smashed them when I was a kid anyway and I'm fine I don't have lung cancer working in a foundry has done more damage to me than anything else Breathing in sand, dust, and powdered lead, leaded gun metal and other nasty stuff. <laughs> That's why I cough like an old man, even though I never really uh, smoked in my life. Anywho, thanks for watching.